Most patients think that if your blood sugar is normal, then you can't have diabetes. Unfortunately, most doctors think that as well. Others know better, and we'll talk about that in this brief video. This uh, article was sent to me by one of the viewers, and again, I get great information from viewers. This was way back, Diabetes Magazine, uh, December of 04. But it underlines a couple of things. The first and maybe most important thing is with stage one diabetes, you have normal blood sugar levels. It's just that your pancreas is struggling to push uh, sugar back into those cells or into those cells despite resistance. So you get normal blood sugars but high insulin values. That's why we look at insulin values as well. Stage two, you're starting to get those higher blood sugars. Stages one and two, I've seen patients stay in those stages for decades. Stage three is a transient level. Three is where you're starting to lose it. Your pancreas is starting to lose it. Stages four and five are more of what we call frank or complete type two diabetes. I go a lot more into detail on this and what this means in terms of uh, ketosis versus ketoacidosis, whether or not you can cure diabetes or these stages. You can reverse these stages. I go into a lot more detail in another video on this. This is just a summary for the people that like short videos. And for those of you that, that made it this far, thanks for your interest. By the way, if you're interested, check out our website. We're going to have an event at University of Louisville Conference Center where you can get your CIMT and all your labs. And we'll have a two-day boot camp experience going over all of that.